show hope you had a great time listening a little bit of headaches with the nbn but um they're the headaches we have to uh, live with i suppose these days uh, you want to get a, a great read uh, sit back and um, enjoy or do, doing something while it's raining then um, the magazine it's the one with the big spanish map on the front there this morning and certainly um, a number of great articles inside three days after a jury convicted former police officer Mohammed Noor of murder and manslaughter over the death of Sydney woman Justine Damon Ruschek. Minneapolis Mayor Jacob Frey says this is a way for the city to move forward. And I do believe that we will move forward together, united in the shared belief that such a tragedy should never occur in our city. Ms. Damon Ruschek was shot and killed by Noor as she approached his vehicle after she'd called 911 to report a possible rape behind her house. She's in custody awaiting sentencing in June. English voters frustrated with the deadlock over Brexit have punished both the ruling Conservatives and the main opposition Labour Party in local elections. Peter Simpson reports. With all of the results counted, the Conservative Party suffered a net loss of 1,332 seats, down by around a quarter. Labour lost 81. The main beneficiaries of the swing against the two main parties were the pro-EU Liberal Democrats and the Greens. The Lib Dems gained 73 seats, with the leader, Savinsk Cable, describing every vote received as a vote for stopping Brexit. The pro-